Welcome to another SCDTV Review Division production for Gunfire and today we're gonna talk about some Russian Rifles Strike from LCT uh, Previously uh, we got our heads, hands on this beauty uh, This is a LCT AS Val Now, guys from Taiwan came up with another vir vir variation of this design which is SR3M uh, This is a technically the same design as in AGN Real Steel World as this one however with some minor modification in front department Here we have a full steel construction of this SR3M uh, full steel body, uh, oxidized uh, full steel uh, upper receiver cover and a full steel skeleton buttstock folded, folded. Does it hold? Yep Even better than the, than the, than the valve Yeah, even better uh, than in this one Alright, unfold it Okay, and here are the differences uh, from the previous valve. The front. Uh, we have a plastic, uh, it's not a handguard because it's empty here, plastic front uh, and a vertical foregrip, right? For better you know, holding performance. Uh, and a short barrel with a steel thread. Uh, the LCT uh, prepared, however, it's not out yet. A SR3M silencer, which you can mount directly onto it, right? Yeah. Okay, now, uh, in real life, this is a short, compact, close quarter weapon, uh, same as for the Airsoft World. It is very compact design, comfortable, comfortable? Yeah, very much. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, do you prefer the vertical foregrip or this strange silencer? I always love the vertical foregrip. Yeah build quality. Just like in this one, everything is put together very, very nicely, right? No loose parts, the cover, nothing wobbles. Except the, uh, the handguard. The handguard wobbles a bit. Okay, we got slight movement of the front, front grip. We think, we hope that it won't fall apart, right? It's plastic, right? But with something inside, no. Plastic foregrip wobbles a bit, but not a biggie. In here, everything is rock solid. The stock, you can chop the trees with it. Okay, uh, let's begin with the folding stock, skeleton stock. Here we have a molds from welding. Uh, it looks solid as you saw. Solid bad stock. Absolutely no movement. Swing swivel. Oh, what? My sling. Whatever. It is rock solid. Now, the oxidized steel body, lower receiver, uh, receiver cover. All right. Now, the bolt carrier. Uh, and the hop-up unit, pretty easy to adjust when this thing is removed. Gearbox type 3 inside, pretty solid it looks. Wiring, of course, goes to front. Now, the famous or infamous fire selector, it's mechanical, no electrical. Uh, people say, from Val experience, that it isn't that reliable, but you know, in Addy's valve it still works, so it depends, I guess. The magazine release and the magazine hatch. Now you're gonna see some problems. Okay, once you get the hang of it, it's easy, but you need to know your moves, as I said before. Now the plastic handguard. Uh, to remove it oh 
I need to press it. I need to just like okay now. Uh, you see we connected quite large battery in here we put it in this compartment it is good because it's easy uh, you can use a duct tape no problem however there's one thing if you want to fold this grip here's the button now if for some reason you want to close it uh, fold it uh, it's impossible with the battery inside so either you you know forget about it uh, or find a battery that will fit here which is quite tricky I guess all right all right now here we have sides uh, typical flip up side and the front side here and of course the huge thread for your huge uh, silencer which you can get from LCT in near future uh, now if you're not satisfied with the precision uh, with the accuracy get yourself a longer barrel and a silencer and it will do I guess now here we have the mount it's typical Russian mount it's supposed to fit most of the Russian uh, optics or rail uh, attachments we managed to put a what on it PKA PKA with red, no, problem. no problem with no problem uh, if other works well you need to find it yourself probably same as Val some months will need work gearbox type 3 LCT internals means it shoots but the, the gearbox works pretty good right same was here in, in this one yeah so no strange sounds no squeaky you know squeaks just proper gearbox work uh, the hop-up unit is a AK style or is a bit of different something yeah it's a typical AK plastic one yeah yeah one of the best things of this LCT uh, construction I mean Val's uh, VSS probably and this one SR3M are the magazines they are cheap they are middle low cups, which is best, right? Yeah. Uh, and they're cheap, right? They look good, but they are cheap. So you can get a lot of them uh, for a very, very affordable price. We're gonna check uh, the actual capacity of the magazine. Uh, here we have a about 90s BBs, 90 BBs, and we're gonna try if it accommodate all of them how much left around 30 30 so it's a typical low capacity magazine with about 60 bb's uh, capacity right we're gonna test the range and accuracy on me uh, first i'm gonna move for about uh, 30 meters and he's gonna try to hit my bottom right okay try to hit my uh, back and then aim for the bottom hold on ow, I, ow come on enough uh, I was getting shots here 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 and here where were you aiming now I'm about uh, 40 meters we're gonna try if he can hit me with this shot barrel weapon okay here here okay 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 chill okay so I was getting hit uh, mostly on my bottom uh, and on my back some BBs flew on my old shoulders hit me, hit me on my shoulders okay now we're gonna try the maximum effective range now uh, try to hit me okay ow now most of the BBs hit me in my uh, torso and 
here tights area so uh, the range is very very satisfactory straight from the box however uh, the grouping uh, so the precision well not that great you need to work on a probably more precision barrel to get better results as for the gripping however the range very very good okay uh, to sum up this brand new product from LCT uh, SR3M from AS Val VSS line quite a interesting option for all your Russian gear fans right nowadays even valves and VSS are nothing you know spectacular but this one is still fresh so quite a good option so you won't be you know one of many but you can be a first of many <laughs> uh, technically is the probably the same beast as this one which stands for excellent gearbox performance right mm -hmm. uh, some work needed for better uh, accuracy quite good range uh, but what is more important most important it is build quality which is excellent especially in the steel department some loose parts uh, of the plastic side but you know it's everywhere in the AEG department so excellent build quality quite good impression let's call it impression of the actual real steel firearm right don't in my belly uh, so well, it is known from LCT that they make uh, Russian gear very very accurate right same is here so if you want a Russian gun that looks cool and it's not AS Val and VSS which are now plenty of them around SL3M is a good option and what is really really cool stuff about it that the magazines are cheap low capacity and they work very very good so what else do you want from LCT from SR3M I don't know I, th I think it's enough <laughs>